Okay, I'm going to show you how to uh, copy a path and use it for a camera position. Get it all oriented correctly. So um, here we go. I've got uh, just a simple project set up here. Got three little solids distributed in Z space, like you would normally set up a set. Okay, I've got a camera. Okay, and a null, which we'll use later. Okay, we have a uh, solid on the bottom here. It's a 2D solid we are going to draw our camera path on. But we want to draw the path so that we can see where the camera is going to go. So let's make this a 3D solid and let's rotate it 90 degrees in X. Okay. Now we can select it, use our pen tool to draw the camera path. Okay, so we'll just take the pen tool and you don't actually have to be on the layer. We want to start back here about where the camera is and make our path around to these layers. That's about all there is to it. Now what we want to do, now you want to set a keyframe for the mask path. Just make sure that everything is selected. We're going to copy that. We're going to go to the camera and we'll set a keyframe for the camera position and we'll paste. Okay, now let's stretch out. These are row over time keyframes. The only problem is when we do that you notice that the camera now moves in XY. We want it to move in YZ. The solution to that is to parent the camera to this null, okay? Rotate the null 90 degrees in X, okay? And then get the camera right side up again, remove the parent. That's all we needed the null for. You can delete it or leave it in the comp, doesn't make any difference. We don't need this blue solid anymore. We just turn it off in case we want to adjust our path later and now everything is going just fine there's a little flip in the camera there that's because the camera is probably set to orient towards point of interest which is the default so we change it to orient along the path there we go camera flies through our jungle just the way it's supposed to